This next study is going to be very easy to review, primarily because all the information is laid to bear in a clean, easy to define format, including the outcome itself. So let us proceed. Probiotics can protect the skeletons of older women. For the first time in the world, researchers at the University of Gothenburg, Sweden have demonstrated that probiotics, dietary supplements with health promoting bacteria, can be used to affect the human skeleton. Among older women who received probiotics, bone loss was halved compared to women who received only a placebo. Kind of makes you feel bad for those that received placebo after this total of a year. The research opens the door to a new way to prevent fractures among the elderly. All right, let's sidestep to the abstract itself because the abstract contains a little bit more detailed data in regard to dosing length of time and outcome. The objective of this trial was to investigate if l ruteri 6475 affects bone loss in older women with low bone mineral density. In this double-blind, placebo-controlled study, women from the population who were 75 to 80 years old and had a low bone mineral density were randomized to orally receive 10 to the 10th power, don't panic, that just means 10 billion, colony forming units, viable bacteria, of l ruteri 6475 daily or placebo. The predefined primary endpoint was relative change after 12 months in the tibia total volumetric bone mineral density. And to reiterate, the outcome was that bone loss was halved compared to women who received only the placebo. So, to conclude, and to quote the researcher, when we finished the study after a year, again, this is a quote, we measured the women's bone loss in their lower legs with a CT scan and compared with the measurements we made when the study began. The women who received the powder with active bacteria had lost only half as much bone in the skeleton compared with those who received the inactive powders, powders says Anna Nielsen, please forgive me if I pronounced it incorrectly, the chief physician, physician and associate professor at the University of Gothenburg. Another positive outcome, continuing with the quote, from the study was that the treatment was well tolerate, tolerated and did not produce more side effects than those experienced by women who received the placebo. So, real, real promising research into l ruteri in regard to reducing bone loss down very, very significantly. We're talking about half after only 12 months. So with that in mind, I hope you find this information of use. The UI citation will be linked as always so you can follow the information on your own. And thank you as always for listening and look forward to seeing you all again next week. Thank you. Catch you next time. Bye.